How do you pump down the refrigerant into the outdoor unit of the mini split? You gotta make sure there's power. You gotta make sure you have your gauge hooked up with your hose and your adapter. The valves are open. We just finished replacing the main controller, right? So now we're gonna take and we're gonna engage the cooling operation. So what we do is we take the controller, hit the cool mode, run it all the way down. Then we're gonna come to our gauge. The unit's gonna fire up and start running, which it just did. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna close the bottom suction, a liquid line service valve. And when you close that valve, that is gonna take and pump the refrigerant from that evaporator and the line sets into the outdoor unit. You can see as the unit pumps that refrigerant, it's gonna pull down to zero. This is gonna keep our charge in our outdoor unit and our unit is gonna be charged. So you can see right now it is going down to 50. And every time we finish a repair, we've got to pump down the unit. That's after we charge it. So here we go. Almost there. And when it hits zero, that's when you're going to close that valve. Or a little bit before. All right, so right there, zero. We're going to take and go to our suction line service valve, the top one. And we're going to close that suction line service valve. And when it's closed, we're going to take and we're going to cut the breaker off. That's how you pump down the refrigerant. Now we can take the unit apart, line sets and all, box it up, fill out our report, and then our unit is factory charged.